boys back with another Link Sense video. Man, hopefully none of you guys, um, you know, went out there, you know, throwing all type of fragrances in your cart. You know, when they thought that $2,000 was going to pass. And then Mitch McFucktar just said, nope, not today. No creed for you. Stick to your fucking Adidas cologne. But anyways, man, I got a fragrance for you guys that even with that $600 you can easily afford. It is very affordable. I think it's less than 30 bucks. The fragrance is beautiful. It's sophistication. It's classy. It's sexy. It's warm. It's vibrant. This stuff is just so damn good. Now, the fragrance I'm going to be talking about, um, I actually cannot really find any real note breakdown. I've seen... Uh, websites that say what it kind of smells like, but there's actually no real note breakdown anywhere. Couldn't find it out for brand cut, can't find it anywhere. Okay, now this fragrance is from the house of Rihanna, not the singer Rihanna. She probably makes dope shit too. I don't know, I never smelled them. But this is from the house of Rihanna, and this is Musky Oud. Bro, this stuff is lovely. You guys, you get a nice sillage. You get a nice scent bubble for two hours. That sillage will stay with you pretty much two to three hours. The performance on this, eight to ten hours easily. On clothes, day after, two days after, you're going to have to wash that stuff off to get rid of the smell. Even sometimes when you wash the clothes, you are not going to get rid of that smell. This stuff is that damn good. But let me spray this real quick. Now again, there's real, there's not a real note breakdown with this fragrance. However, this stuff smells like this rich, dark leather when I smell it. Nice tobacco, you get a little bit of saffron. It's kind of adding this nice spicy sweetness to it. Now it says there's a hint of berries in there. I'm not sure if that's, you know, again, where some of that little sweetness is coming from. But that could be that as well as that saffron being saffron, giving it that sweet, spicy smell. But man, the leather in this stuff is so beautiful you guys i'm gonna spray it again i actually got a dry down on this handle already which is still smelling excellent i sprayed this on literally six seven hours ago okay so i'm gonna give you guys a fresh spray look at that juice the juice is nice on this nice distribution of that juice right here again look at that bottle you guys that bottle just screams elegance right there if you got that sitting on your cologne collection or perfume collection that thing is going to look dope. Now, I'm not sure if that's considered a fucking uh, batch code or anything like that, or that that's supposed to say it's authentic, but I'm assuming it's authentic because the stuff lasts all day, you guys. Man, right from the top, you get this nice, huge blast of leather, and then I am starting to get a little bit of that sweetness with that, maybe that hint of berries that you're getting. It's not too sweet. It's just there, just a little bit. Got this nice tobacco, the saffron. My goodness, this stuff is good, you guys. Man, this screams luxury. This screams going out. You got a nice little sports jacket or maybe even a, even a leather jacket. Boom. Got a nice little black turtleneck on or a black t-shirt like I'm wearing. Boom. This screams fucking class. This screams sexy, sophisticated professionalism this stuff screams everything that you would think of of as a, of a boss okay a boss man type guy right here boss not afraid to take chances right here this stuff i'm telling you guys i'm not just hyping this stuff up for nothing i actually got this on a trade and i cannot believe this guy got rid of it maybe it wasn't for him but this stuff is sexy in my honest opinion <sighs> man this stuff this is one of those fragrances that you can smell all day now it is a little woody and that's probably where you're gonna get that oud that's why it's called oud but you get that like that muskiness that you know musky oud woody smell that's from that leather that saffron you got that tobacco working but man you guys this stuff is very very intoxicating this is not there's ouds that i've smelled before or fragrance that have the word oud in it that i would say that are kind of a little too daring i'm not sure if everyone's gonna like it but honestly i think with this one at least if you get at least 10 people in a room or 10 women in a room and you ask them to smell this i guarantee at least seven out of the ten are really really gonna like this i kid you not it's that good it might even be more than that 
but this is not one of those ones that's off-putting that's going to make you say, oh my God, I'm never going to buy Oud again. This stuff, you guys, if you guys want to try this, get like a blind buy. I think you can get this on Fragrance X right now. I think it's less than 30 bucks, but this stuff is awesome. You guys, I can't say enough about this stuff right here. Man, I love this stuff. The, the dry down is like a nice, sweet, almost like a vanilla, leathery, again, a little bit of tobacco still. Again, there's no real note breakdown in here. All I'm doing is looking at best brand perfumes right now. It's saying there's leather, saffron, and tobacco, leather. The leather is very beautiful in this, you guys. If you guys remember, I did a fragrance a video on the Swiss Arabian. Um, forgot what the name of it was called. It was that white bottle. That leather, I hated it. It stunk. That shit was pure trash, but this stuff is nice, you guys. Look at that atomizer in there, that nice, thick atomizer. You're going to get a lot of juice every time you spray this, so you're going to be have to behave on this sprayer, you guys. You guys don't need that much. Maybe three sprays max, and you're good to go. But there you guys have it. This is that Rihanna Musky Oud. Not even sure if I'm saying that right. It looks like it says Rihanna, but this stuff, A1, sophistication, classy. CEO, boss, gentleman, this stuff, go out and try it, all right? Hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you guys did, hit the likes, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you next time, all right? Peace out. Yeah.